Go through your DVD collection of good movies. Find a copy of Dead Man Walking and listen to the score. The primary type of music used by composer David Robbins is Sufi, the ancient spiritual music of India and Pakistan, particularly Qawwali. Qawwali, which means utterance in Arabic, is the musical medium through which the Sufis of Pakistan and India travel toward a state of mystical bliss. While the kind of music that provides background for serious dramatic films about death, redemption, and execution is not necessarily known for its festive quality, the concert I attended was exactly that, festive. In fact, the whole atmosphere was much more party-like than I anticipated. People laughed along with the artist Amjad Sabri. They clapped in time for some numbers. Occasionally, Sabri, backed up with some excellent drummers, would speak his lyrics to his audience. As a white American woman with no knowledge of the Hindi or Urdu language, attending this completely foreign language concert left me at somewhat of a disadvantage. It felt a bit like watching a foreign language film without subtitles. Nevertheless, the music was lively and inspiring. One of my fellow English-speaking audience members called it transcendent. I had as much fun watching the audience as I did the performers. Sabri asked to bring the lights up slightly. I suspect he wanted to see his audience. This allowed both of us to appreciate the traditional dress of the women arriving in some gorgeous elaborate suits. Some of the musical numbers were improvisational, much like jazz, and though I didn't understand the lyrics, the spontaneous feel of it was enjoyable. Best of all, I think music like this makes you think out of the box. It can't be confined to one genre. If I had to, I'd say it was similar to jazz, with a lyrical storyline, giving it an operatic feel. The drums were reminiscent of Native American music, and the voice of Amjad Sabri was gospel-like in its joyous and uplifting tone.